watching some of the action from earlier. World number one again, Nelly Corda with a birdie at one, a birdie at two, and Karen, this one at three. Well, this third hole is a long par four. We saw her in a graphic measuring 422 yards. That's no problem for Nelly with her length. Wins in her last two starts, seven weeks apart. To pay it off, making short work of the long par four. So birdie, birdie, birdie. Little teeny bit of breeze, Blank. just slightly hurting. And that looked good from the tee. Oh, it's absolutely tremendous with a long iron on these tough par threes. Back to the eighth, and Nelly for a fifth birdie in eight holes. A couple of players I've been talking to this week have said that about these greens, that it's very easy to read more into the putts than there actually is. They tend to be a little bit flatter than your eyes see. And certainly when I was out there walking around the golf course, I was looking at the putts and for sure felt like it was going to break a lot. She's going with a seven iron. Bringing it in over the right bunkers. That was a nice looking swing too. Like really got through that ball well. Yeah, I think that mental strength has really been on, on display. Uh, the past couple of victories that she's had. And, uh, you know, I think that's the final piece of the puzzle for her. Jump off. Oh, that was magnificent. Got a little bit of that release on it because she did take some distance off of it. To Nelly at four under this to get to five under. Okay, we got the men's number one, Scotty Scheffler, off to a good start today in Houston as he tries to win three in a row. Just don't do anything. Don't try to get too cute here. Oh, that was executed beautifully. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> she made that, that look cute. so much yes. easier than it was. Uh, let's toast that one again here. Okay. Well, it does have that little upslope, but you can see, you know, the grass around it. She's just... Gets on in there with the Bermuda grass. I bear in mind, you know, Nelly grew up on Bermuda grass, so she knows. A good 35 footer uphill. Oh. Pretty nice. Judge that speed well. I think that's really the, the most important thing you can do there. Take a look at our insights by KPMG. Karen, highest win probability entering the tournament. You're going to be first if you've won your last two starts. I, uh, that much I can probably guess. Well, yes. I mean, just a small one. This is the club that set up the birdie on the playoff hole against Ryan O'Toole. She's on that on the driving distance hole. You can see that her tee shot went just over 300 yards. That's not too shabby. All right, now live Nelly for birdie. Yeah, that's, uh, again, just falling a little bit flat. Can't quite get any fireworks going in the last hour. 285 to the front. Oh, this going too much to the left unless it gets a good kick. Sure has. Where she was through 10 holes. Nelly took advantage of both par fives on the front, but did not birdie the first par five on the back nine.
Scotty Scheffler, like Nelly, number one in the world, trying to win a third in a row. He shot five under today.